Hey, welcome to the second part of our beginner tutorial series. And uh, today we are looking at uh, the project that we did last week. And in today's uh, topic, we will be creating a roofing to this project. Without further ado, let's get it on and let's, yes, put your hands up, baby, come on. Okay, um, in this area, I'm gonna change this by the way to entryway, not a mudroom. So let me just uh, rename that. And then, um, this guys, these door openings, I want these to be aligned to each other so you can actually align them by typing AL, then uh, click on the center line uh, between the opening, I mean, in the middle of the opening, and uh, align it with the other door opening and make sure to click the pod padlock para any adjustments yung gagawin mo dito sa isang door opening it will also update dun sa kabila all right and then uh, also i would like to put some uh, to put a uh, door opening in on this wall okay now let's move forward and uh add some roof first thing uh we go to uh, 3d then we're gonna check the our output or the 3, 3d model now as you can see there are two existing levels the level one and the level two so level one dito yung floor, uh, main floor natin na naka level or naka base and then uh yung level two naka set siya into 4000 but since uh one floor or bungalow yung ginagawa nating house uh we don't need a level two but we are going to rename this level to two top of roof beam. Dito, uh, magbe-base yung roof natin. Then hit enter. Now just click on yes para ma-update yung naming niya. Tapos, uh, depende din ito sa inyo kung gano'n siya kataas. So we can actually uh, change this to maybe 3, um, 3, 500. And so my level na tayo for the roof beam. Now, uh, what we're going to do next is we're going to create the roof boundary by clicking this blue icon sa level. Double click on that. And then, uh, ito na yung view niya. Okay? Now, we're going to create the boundaries for the roofing. Now, uh, look into the architecture tab. Then, click the roof icon. And... Uh, uh, to me, I'm gonna choose pick lines to make it uh, a little easier and faster. But we at this time we don't have to 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 check the lock, cause we we are gonna offset it, para dun sa eaves nila. Okay, now go ahead and click, uh, the exterior finishes. I mean exterior lines. And. Now you may notice na may triangle siyang kasama. These triangles are actually the slopes of each segment. And um, ayun. now if we try to check or click check, this is how it's going to look. And before that, may pop up siya na would you like to attach the highlighted walls. And we are going to click attach para yung walls na yun ay naka-attach siya sa roof. If we did not click on that attach, what's going to happen? This is how it's going to look like. Kapag hindi siya attach. Okay, so let's get back to that. We click attach. Now, this is how it looks like. Um, we're going to put eaves, but at least uh, it will look nicer and uh, more functional. Double click on that. Let us go back to uh, here. So roof beam level plan view that was uh, we're gonna offset these lines according to uh, the projection you want so for me i'm gonna offset this to 1000 each segment uh, you can click each of the lines but uh, my easier way by uh, dragging your mouse 
towards the, one of the lines. Tapos, um, hit tab. Ayan, mag-highlight yung buong uh, lines or boundary. However, before we click on that, uh, let's uncheck the copy. Kasi, hindi tayo magduplicate ng lines, but uh, we're gonna upset them. Okay? So, uh, again, uh, hit tab. Tapos, ayan. Nagkaroon siya ng error kasi for this one, masyado na siyang masikip that uh, they, they can't uh, make an upset or nag overlap na siya. So, we're gonna delete these lines and uh, and uh, trim these guys down. Ayan. Tapos, also for this part, trim, that's TR, then hit check. Now, this is how it's gonna look like. If you want a gable roof, you can actually click, double click on that roof. Tapos, uh, select the segments yung gusto nyo maging gable. Then, uh, yeah, uncheck nyo lang kung define slope, then hit OK. Ayan, naka-gable na siya. Also, you can change the slope of the roof anytime by clicking that. Tapos, mahanap po siya dito sa properties. You can change the slope to uh, 45. Mag-update yan siya accordingly. So, uh, that's really, really easy. Okay? And then uh, for this for these entries if you want to put some uh, an additional gable roof here just to emphasize the entryway you can actually do that let's double click on the roof that was go back to the roof beam plan elevation so we are going to create a reference plane para malaman natin kung saan natin siya offset now since uh, my eaves din siya i'm going to offset the it to 600 probably that was uh, click on this point Ayan. if nandi nasa right naman yung reference plane uh, you can uh, hit a uh, space bar on your keyboard para mag flip siya to the other side and also for this one and also here Ayan. oops sorry Ayan. okay so next is, uh, we're gonna type in SL, that's slice, para slice natin yung lines na yan. Then uh, hit, uh, type in TM, trim multiple, para ma-separate natin tong lines na to. Then we're gonna add another boundary lines here and here. Oops. Tapos. Also for this one, uh, as a reference, ano lang, reference, a midpoint reference lang natin. Then uh, type in SL, slice that, then trim. And here, type in SL, tapos trim, TM. Tapos i-delete na natin to, we don't need this. Tsaka yan. Now, uh... We are going to remove the slope of these guys. Ayan. Tapos mag add tayo ng uh, slope arrow from this point hanggang sa middle. Ayan. Also for this entry. Then uh, click these arrows. Maglalagay tayo maglalagay tayo ng value for the offset para hindi siya masyado high pitch. So, uh, probably 1,000. Tapos hit check. Now, let's see how it looks like. Ayan. So, that is how it looks like sa model or 3D. So, ayun. Mabilis lang gumawa ng isang basic roof. Now, uh, on the next video, we will be creating the the floor and the ceiling and for now ito lang muna yung topic natin so uh, i hope you guys have catched up and uh, learned i hope to see you again on the next videos have a great day